guys, thank you all for tuning in to Big Mama Story Time. Story Time! Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment to my page. Here we go! Hi guys, thank you all for tuning in to Big Mama Story Time on today. Today I will be reading to you guys a little golden book, Puppy Dog Pals, Walking the Bob. Alright guys, let's get into this book. Roly and Bingo are pugs. Bob is their person. When Roly and Bingo talk, all Bob hears is, Ruff! Ruff! Normally, Bob walks the dogs, but today is different. Today, Bob's doctor has given him some eye drops, so his vision will be blurry for a while. Now, the dogs will have to walk Bob. Mm, mm, mm. Bob can't see very well, Bingo says to Riley. We need to help him get home. Cool, says Riley. That can be our mission. Bob accidentally walks into the coat rack at the doctor's office. He thinks it's a person. Oops, sorry, sir, Bob says. Oh, boy, the puppies really need to help him. Come on, Bob, says Bingo. Follow us. Outside, Bob almost doesn't recognize a couple of his neighbors, Chloe and her mom. My puppies and I are headed home, Bob says to them, but he walks in the wrong direction. The pugs tug on their leashes. Wrong way, Bob, says Bingo. Our house is that way, as Roly. <laughs> Bob, remember, they supposed to be walking you, not you walking them. <laughs> oh, no. Bob pulls the pugs into a park. The puppies try to guide him through the playground safely, but it's tough. <laughs> Going through all types of different obstacles. <laughs> After getting Bob away from the playground, the pups continue to try to walk him home. But he wants to buy flowers. Ruff! Ruff! Bob, those aren't flowers, says Roly. They're drumsticks, <laughs> says Bingo. Oh, he ain't even going to the flower shop. Bob gives a drumstick flower to a policeman. A pretty flower for a pretty lady, Bob says. Ruff, ruff! Bob even tries to give a drumstick flower to a vending machine. Beautiful day, isn't it? Bob says to the machine. Ruff, ruff! I think they're trying to tell him something because it keeps saying it. <laughs> now, Bob wants to buy fruit. He goes into a big store and heads for the sporting goods set. Ow. I don't know what kind of fruit this is, he says, but it's way too hard to eat. That's not fruit, the dog says. That's a golf ball. <laughs> wow, this has got to be the biggest orange ever, says Bob. That's not an orange, Bingo and Rolly says. It's a basketball. Bingo and Roly get an idea. They push shopping carts into Bob's path to steer him toward the fruit section. Oh, smart dogs. Back outside the store, Bob feels some drops and thinks it's raining. It's not raining, says Roly. Someone is watering plants above us. I guess Bob can't tell the difference. Bingo says. Bob wants to buy a rain hat. He goes into a store. That's the music store again, Bob, says Bingo. They don't sell flower or hats in there, Roly asks. And that's not a rain hat, they tell him when he comes out. It's a drum! <laughs> All that in rough, rough, y'all. Bingo and Riley walk Bob onto a bus. Bob thinks he's still out on the sidewalk, so while the bus drives along, he keeps walking. Bingo and Riley guide him past the other passengers, and right out the back door, they've made it to their neighborhood. <laughs> they made it back home. I can barely see it. But I'm pretty sure that's my house right there, says Bob. We did it, shout Riley and Bingo. Yay! <laughs> they happy. They got him home safely. <laughs> the next morning, Bob can see well again. It's Bob, Roly and Bingo say when Bob comes downstairs to greet him. He's awake. But all Bob hears is, 
Ruff, ruff. <laughs> Sounds like my dogs, guys. All right, guys, that is Puppy Dog Pals, Walking Bob. Thank you all for tuning in to Big Mama Storytime. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my page if you haven't done so already. All right, guys, bye.